Hello everyone. It's another video. This one uh, we rented a 12 inch chipper from the Home Depot. It's one of their compact power rentals. Uh, it's the biggest chipper we could find. There's a couple other rental companies that rent some other versions of a 12 inch chipper. Uh, they all seem to be about the same specs. 75 horsepower diesel engine. Um, hydraulic uh, feed, line feed. It's got a 12 inch feeder. Pretty big opening. And uh, we've been running it through its numbers and testing it out. Cuts pretty good. I'd say the biggest issue that I've uh, run into so far is just, uh, you know, putting decent sized branches in there makes the RPMs drop and then the feed stops until the RPMs pick back up. And I mean, it's what you'd expect from a normal chipper, but um, it's just not quite as fast as we were hoping. Uh, we typically have been running it with two people picking up brush um, one person chainsaw another person using the grapple to bring it over and uh, four people with that has been uh, more than this chipper can handle two people feeding that thing in will be waiting one person to pick up a branch throw it in it will start grinding it but the other person's just kind of standing there waiting to throw theirs in and vice versa so i'll take some some video in just a minute about uh about how well it runs we'll show you i mean it's a decent unit from what i'm looking at all of them are about the same but you could probably use some more horsepower all right so this is the control panel where you operate this uh device this chipper so we're gonna go ahead and crank it up make sure that the emergency stop button is pulled out turn the key on and press the start key start button here's some stuff on the LCD ready to start always wear earplugs It idles at about 800 RPMs, and it chips between 2,000 and 2,200 RPMs.
right, so we're going to return this. I've had it about a week now. We actually had to exchange it for another one. So you see in one video it was 18, now it's 16. It's because we actually were having some uh, troubles with that unit. But I just want to say a couple things to close. One, there may be some parts of the video where you see me not wearing safety glasses. That's uh, stupidity there. Don't do what I do, just wear some safety glasses. Uh, I usually do, I just probably forgot when, uh, when we were doing the video. Another thing is, is definitely wear ear protection. Um, unlike safety glasses where you can forget, this thing will not let you forget that you need to wear ear protection. I don't even know what to uh, compare it to other than maybe standing behind a jet when you're freaking fixing to take off. It's very loud. It's extremely loud. So uh, This thing has a safety control bar. It's another thing there. It's very touchy for a reason, but it allows that thing to spin forward, stop, or spin in reverse. Uh, so that way if things feed in, they don't feed in properly, you need to pull them out, stump's too big, something of that nature, you can uh, kick it out. Of course, you can try to reverse it if it sucks you in. Hopefully that never happens. Anyways, so this was a Home Depot rental, 12-inch chipper. I've got some video of some of the things we chipped with it. I'll put it all together on this video. And uh, as always... If y'all guys like the videos and if it was helpful, please like the video and subscribe to our channel. Helps us out. I'll keep trying to make videos. Alright, thanks everyone.